Hey. Please forget everything that you heard. Oh. I gave that girl a high five. High five, high five. Stay in your place. You remember the precious and mine is called Joe Yes. Yes. Hey, would you trip your boat, girl? So, what does Super 16 mean? I don't even know if I asked you that. What does uh, that mean? Super 16 is. My rap name is Nick Astro. We got a project called Super 16. And I started like writing my songs as if like they were a movie. So like if you listen to the song, I want you to like visualize like what I'm going through. How I came up with the concept was that I made this song called Say Cheese and it was just a long verse. And so I wanted to make a project and I was like, man, I should make a project with just long verses. And I figured like I call them super sisteens. <laughs> Yes. Nah. <laughs> that, that was that was not gonna work at all. Not gonna, people barely listen to people rap. Like I was just at a show yesterday, and this dude he was headlining, and people were on their phones. That we were talking about on the way here. Me seeing you at a show the other day, yeah. you know, Jeff being here, it's becoming less about music and more about just like networking and having to be somewhere. Yeah. What's your angle on trying to maintain people's attention? I like to be interactive, but you can't be too interactive because you, you, gotta, re you gotta realize that people came to see a showcase. One thing I like to do is, is to have a dramatic arc in my, my showcase, I like to tell a story. All the songs I'm about to do is gonna tell like a narrative story. So just catch the story that I'm trying to tell you guys. I started off with Shorty at a backside. She was my sunshine. Then I just did Scarlett Johansson. Who's my sunshine? Scarlett Johansson. Now. It, uh, then I did Kanye West, All Falls Down, which talks about insecurity. Yeah. Yeah. This the real one, baby. I'm telling you. So long that it looked like weed. Then she cut it all off. Now she looked like Eve. Okay. We usually walk through the back door, but the back ain't working. Yeah, this is life. Shit is real. And we ain't perfect. Got these bills to struggle. I'm for certain. Don't tell my pastor. If your name ain't on this least girl, you the least girl. That's not on the live but you know to see you in the now yeah. through your work is kind of amazing so do you think that um you know are there any songs on the tape now that you're like oh my god like i've kind of because it's been a while yeah it is so it are you looking at them now you're like oh my gosh there's like what's crazy about that there's one song that when i started the concept of super team that's on the tape and it's called Let Me Explain. Yo, Quiz. Why you around the hip hop? Yo, Quiz. Hey, bro, why you got so many styles? And why you never around, bro? Why you never down? Yo, Quiz. Hey, yo, Quiz. Can I get your autographs? 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 Hey, yo, would you say that they inspire a lot of your work? Uh, Show and Dre? Yeah. Yes. Uh, I take a lot of notes from their performances. I take stuff that like I can use and be like, oh man, I can do that just in my way. And then there's stuff that they do that's like, oh, I can't do that. I don't see anybody moshing at my performances <laughs> at all. <laughs> I want to know if I can do that, but just like in this way. When I say Nick, y'all say before I even start, I want to give props out to my homie Nick Astro. He's got a project coming out on his shirt. It's called Super, Super 16. 16. Real quick, we want to run this. We want to do a track. You cool with doing Rain Man Fly? Let's do it. To make sure there's a generation of rappers don't rap like you. you right over these lines now. Copy my style. No black that white now. Yeah, so what is the concept? Concept. The yeah, concept. It's perfect. Behind I'm broke. I'm Whatever. broke? Yeah. If there's any pretty lady that wanna take me out to lunch after the show, <laughs> I'm down because I'm I'm super broke right now. You broke nigga? I'm broke too. You broke nigga? I'm broke too. You broke nigga? I'm broke too. You broke nigga? I'm broke too.
broke, nigga, I'm broke too. You broke, nigga, I'm broke too. I got raps and he's broke too. When I say this, y'all say this. I got y'all, I'm already beat. Mike and Joe, that's the MC. Stacey King, like, he beat. I'm smoking these tree trees. My brother used to call me a pimp squeak. I used to be a snot nosed kid, but I probably end up on a billboard this week. You probably thought you could rap, but you probably thought you could fly too. This this particular uh, Andre 3000 line didn't inspire the song. Uh, it kind of relates to the song. If you don't move your feet, then I don't eat. So like re like neck to neck or something like 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 every week oh, you get. Yeah, it is a grind out here. Like, I pay thirty dollars an hour, which is one twenty a week. Yeah, they want to blow my crib up, but they'll never find a leg cow. I did enunciated that wrong. Let me hear that. Get pulled over and asked the cop, "Hey, why you at my window for?" I don't usually do jabs, but yo, I see you, bruh. I'm gonna be real with you, G. I could use that thousand dollars or something. You know? <laughs> I just care more about my career <laughs> than I do paying eighteen hundred dollars for a Mac. Right? <laughs> South by Southwest, we met there. Yes. Um, how is your experience there? It was amazing. Uh, Seventy percent of the time I was at South by Southwest, I was by myself. Most of it is me walking around, just filming random stuff, yeah, like I've the most. Seen that. So would you say that being at South by Southwest uh, furthered your career? Like, did you meet a lot of different people? I actually met Anthony, who actually works with me now. I met you. I met Jake. I actually met my DJ at South by Southwest. Oh. That you have a lot of competition you know, coming into Chicago. I mean, not even with just the date, but just, you know, being in the scene, there's a lot, a lot of people coming up, and I think it's a really opportune time to be in the scene, but yeah. you get intimidated. Sometimes I, not even intimidated, I get discouraged. Mm -hmm. But as far as competition, well, I was telling my homie Fonz yesterday, I have these debates on, like, who's the best, and, like, you know what I'm saying? Or who's better than this rapper? Like, not even amongst ourselves. And basically, like, my response to that is, like, Every rapper should feel like they're the best rapper because they should feel that there's no other rapper that can do what they can do. When you, once you create your own lane, you are the best. You are the best at that lane that you created. Hey, time out. Hip Hop Rice Space, Tumblr, was that, was that the other one? LinkedIn, Black Planet, <laughs> Club, Penguin, Reddit, Cartwheel.com, shit I just made up. ISI, Chicago.com, MovieHorner.com, PornHub.com, Amazon, eBay, on Kickstarter, Indiegogo, Craigslist, EMZ, Vibe Magazine, Double SL, Complex, Chicago Reader, Red Eye. May Scarlet fall in love with me, may not be all that stupid now, just. <laughs> it's here. All the people who are asking, hey, bro. Hey man, when you dropping that super system? Hey, next month. Now listen to these beats I'm about to make, yeah? Hey. Now listen to these raps I'm about to make, yeah? Hey.